<laughs> Good morning. Coming up is a nice step by step guide how to install the new timber feathered edge fencing. So stay tuned and uh, if you like what you see, hit that like button. I've already said it. Recording. Oh, is it recording? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> from Airdale. From Just another video. Just another one, yeah. As you can see. Yeah, as you can see. <laughs> Alright, ready? Yeah, yeah, Alright, morning guys. Just in from Airdale. They love it. We've just been having a laugh about that. Um, as you can see, get that one in there as well. Um, lads are on a job here today, Thornton. Uh, just a domestic job, 1.5 high, paling fencing. Um, they've already been putting the post in this morning. Same thing as usual, we're going to do uh, step two of your guide today as well to uh, show you exactly how to finish off the fence with the rails and the pails. Uh, Jamie's going to be talking you through all the measurements, sizes, while I uh, get myself off and uh, just clear some rubble away. But um, this is the first job, I, you know, dig the hole, put the posts in, Post picks it up. So getting distracted by these two laughing in background. Look at <laughs> Can hear you whispering. What? Oh dear. <laughs> They'll uh, dig all holes, get all posts in, and then uh, we'll do a proper step by step with the rails and pour, uh, rails and palings. Um, what we're going to be doing, if you want to come through here, watch this with your head. And then, as we showed you on the last video, they've set up the lines, line on the bottom, line on top to see the height. I don't know, it's really hard to see probably on the videos, but these two. What he had done previously was this, and he just wanted it to match. <laughs> so he had this in to match. And uh, he just wanted us to finish off the rest of the garden to match this. So uh, if we have a look at the front, the front is going to be a 1.2 meters high single sided paling with a 1.2 gate to match. And then the side what the lads are actually digging now is going to be a 1.5 meter high single paling. Yeah. Right, so I'm just going to explain to you how to set up the rails and uh, what measurements they use for the rails and uh, how you go about doing it obviously you need the right tools to be able to do it rails when you're doing a 1.5 meter high fence like this is so from there 26 and then at the bottom 52 that's for 1.5 meter what we're doing today obviously it varies if you're doing 1.8 1.2 that's the measurements for today's job um, obviously once you post the setting like they are it's come along with nail gun start attaching your posts measure it up each one go down each section gets done at a time what we will do is we'll show you i'm actually putting the rails in on the video you've got And then if you want to bring that over here and we'll have a look what 
like he's exactly doing. So basically what he's doing now is he's took one of these, gives you your inch gap, and he's using that to measure each space between the paling. And as you can see, he just goes along with a well level, make sure it's straight, puts his piece of wood in, fires away with a nail gun. Is it just a one inch gap you leave? Just a one inch gap. That's a, obviously, he's asked for a one inch gap. He's asked it to match his existing fencing. What's a one inch gap? Um, obviously you can, you can go, you know, one and a half inch, you can go two inch. All depends on really personal preference and how much of a gap you want to leave. What would you say standard is, user? Two. two yeah. Inch. Two inches usually standard, but obviously he's already got fencing up what's got an inch gap in, hence why we do it an inch. What you've got to remember is if, if you do an inch, you need more timber. You do two inch, you need less timber. Well, usually, once you've got the post and the rails in and the cap in put on, it's pretty much nail gun time and off you go. You get fired from this bit pretty easy, don't you, Maggie? Yep. It's the best bit of job, really, isn't it? <laughs> Knackered. Hope you enjoyed our step-by-step -step guide to installing timber feathered edge fencing. If you like to, any more sort of step-by-step -step guides, let us know in the comments. Uh, if you like in general what we do, give us a thumbs up, a like, and thank you very much. Till next time. <laughs>